used to cost billions of dollars to set up big systems. So when you wanted to create a system for renting cars or the old Minitel system, it used to cost so much money that people who had money did all the innovation, the Bell Labs and the big IBMs of the world. But as the costs started to go down, the computers got cheaper, connectivity got cheaper, you didn't need money to start something. So you look at Google, Facebook, Yahoo, they didn't have to have any money, and they didn't have any permission, and they weren't in a big institution, they were students sitting in a dorm room doing something that the teacher didn't necessarily tell them to do. So, so what's important when the innovation cost goes down is you don't need big institutions, you don't need MBAs, you don't need a plan, you just need the ability to use the tools make the thing and put it on the internet. Because in the old days you had to build your network. Well now you just connect it to the internet and everyone in the world can use your service. So for, for internet services and software, everyone knows right now that the innovation is not happening in big research labs, it's happening in venture startups, it's happening on the edges on the street. 